Douglas, what are you doing? Come on, Douglas, what are you doing? Here's another weekend update from the main central lower road. build stuff here <laughs> it may seem like catastrophe going on but when you start pulling stuff out and using it this is what you get this is a structure we'll go downstairs in a minute and show you where this is going to fit in at we've been working on that and the other structure we've been working on is that kind of back river crossing bridge and I'm going to take all this downstairs and uh, kind of show you where it's supposed to go it's not going to be mounted yet obviously still working on it now you can see the uh, Augusta Bridge crossing that I'm working on, or the uh, Kennebec River crossing out of Augusta going on. So I showed you this removable access plate here that will mount the main bridge here. And what it is, it used to be double track going across the river, but by the 1970s, it was single track. And uh, actually it was done much earlier than that, but in the 70s it was single track. So one side, which is the side closest to me, will have the actual track running across 
The other side was just have ties running across the bridge. The building I showed you upstairs goes in this little corner right here. The actual building went down to street level. And this is not an exact replica, but it's good enough stand in for what I got going here. And then on this backdrop here, I'll have a, another large industry, which will actually be rail served. The other thing I got to do is go in here and do all these sidewalks. So there'll be sidewalks coming down here, all the way down underneath there in front of the building. And then obviously paint the road. The other side of the road here was actually a parking lot, so I'll fill that in. And then I've got to touch up this corner here and put some uh, building structure in there where there's another building. So that's the weekend update. I've actually got a much more detailed video that's going to talk about how I built this thing from start to finish. Part of that's going to be actually how I do the water on the actual Kennebec River. And uh, I just want to get some out there because it's been a little bit of time since I uh, put anything out.